to Great Art Collectibles here for an action figure review. Today we are looking at the 2019 Marvel Legends Silver Sable. She comes in a standard Hasbro Marvel Legends box. At the back is a bio and a product shot. Out of the packaging, I like the choice of face sculpt and hair design Hasbro has picked. I'm glad they did not choose a retro look as shown in this 1991 Impel trading card. The costume design is all painted except for the gloves which is sculpted. It always frustrates me how MCU figures get sculpted costume while comic book ones rarely has any of these details. She has loose legs accessories as well. She comes with King Finn's left arm whose fist has the red ring. Besides the retro whip kingpin, the arms are exactly the same. White with a black shirt. Unlike other superheroes, Silver Sable does not have superpowers. She relies on her fighting skills and a lot of money. She first appeared in The Amazing Spider-Man, issue number 265, published June 1985. Silver Sable's gunmen are in the process of catching the Black Fox. However, Spider-Man thought the gunmen are the bad guys, so Spidey battled Silver Sable's men and this allowed the Black Fox to escape. Silver Sable is introduced as a very wealthy lady, the owner of Silver Sable International. She has excellent fighting skills and extensive firepower. Most of the elements from her first appearance costumes are carried over to the succeeding costumes that she wore. Especially the chai attached to her belt and leg strap. As for marble.com, the chai are pointed throwing weapons of her own design. These half moon projectiles are an important signature weapon of her. In different occasions, Silver Sable teams up with different superheroes, especially Spider-Man. First appeared in the Web of Spider-Man number 50, the group known as the Outlaws is a team composed of reformed villains led by Spider-Man. The team includes Silver Sable, Sandman, Puma, Prowler, Rocket Racer, and Will O the Wisp. In 1992, in celebration of the 30th anniversary of Spider-Man, she finally gets her own comic book series. Silver Sable and the Wild Pack includes Sandman and in the first issue, a special guest appearance of Spider-Man. Silver Sable International drive the national economy of a fictional small European state of Simcaria. Simcaria is adjacent to Latveria, a nation ruled by Dr. Doom. So Silver Sable has a diplomatic relationship with Dr. Doom. Silver Sable does not come with alternate hands. She only has a right weapon holding hand and a left trigger finger hand. She comes with two different kinds of black silverish guns. In 2018, a year before the release of this figure, the Domino action figure came with the same set of guns but in purple. Domino also uses the same back harness you can see here that it's the exact same sculpt. Every detail is the same, including the attached pockets on the straps. Attachments. Also in 2018, the Daily Deadpool action figure came out. You can see that the belt is reused. The only difference is Lady Deadpool has a logo, but all the pockets are the same. The strap, or the harness on her back is the same as Lady Deadpool's and also the, the leg straps they're exactly the same with different color for Lady Deadpool. The figure stands 16 centimeters or 6.3 inches. According to marble.com she is listed 5 feet and 5 inch tall. Here are some Marvel Legends comparison beginning with Wolverine and Spider-Man. Magic and Gwen Stacy, Paladin and Puma, Kingpin and Caliban, the Mafex Gambit and the Marvel Legends Warpath, 7 inch scale Marvel Select comparison beginning with Psylocke and Rogue, 
Gambit and Juggernaut, Colossus and Sabretooth. For the articulation, her head can look from side to side. It cannot look up because of her hair. She can look down. Her arms can stretch that far. She can do a full 360, single jointed elbow, swivel on the wrist, hinge forward and back. She can crunch forward a bit, scrunch forward backwards. She has an upper thigh swivel right here, double jointed knees. She can kick that far and feet can hinge forward and back and an ankle rocker. Should you buy this figure? Overall, it is a good looking one with mostly reused accessories. In comic book, Silver Sable uses a normal looking gun such as the one that came with the 2021 The Hood action figure. Instead of providing a leg strap with her iconic weapon, the Chai, Hasbro reused a very frustrating leg strap which does not stay in place. The Chai, which is a weapon designed by Silver Sable, is a must and an essential weapon for this character. Similar to the loose moon disc throwing weapons included in the Moon Knight action figure, Hasbro should have included a similar loose chai weapon pieces. In my opinion, one better way of doing this is to have the chai attached to the alternate throwing hand, similar to how they design the Gambit action figure with throwing cards. Since Silver Sable is a minor character, not like the big Spider-Man villains, I guess this is the only chance that we might get this figure. In some ways, it is understandable why Hasbro reused most of its part. However, I still believe that Hasbro should have been faithful to the comic book character design. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hope you can share it to others. Please do like, subscribe, comment, and ring the notification bell.